We've had a lot of fun exploring Arizona, but it's good to be home. We've come to love Arizona. There's a, a lot of different parts of Arizona, and some of the parts that we've spent a lot of time in are at like four and 5,000 feet, so it's not that hot, dry desert that you think of when you see a saguaro cactus out in the desert in Arizona. Uh, a lot of it is cool, even in the summertime, uh, up there where my son's ranch is. Anyway, um, this video is about our last day in Arizona before coming home here to Mexico. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. Last day in Arizona. Yeah. Ready to go home to Ajijic, Mexico? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah? It's been a long trip and what? we had a lot of good times and now it's time for us to go home and try and recreate some of those dreams. <laughs> Uh, well, yeah, we're packing. We're packing suitcases and washed the refrigerator out. Got it all ready to go, clean. More suitcases back there. Are you going to miss uh, the ranch here in Arizona? Yes, I am. Well, we've had a and good... And my son, I'm going to miss him. Yeah, me too. Speaking of Sky Island Adventures, there's the famous Peter Clausen. It's the Sky Island shuttle bus that takes people around looking for insects and birds and interesting things to see here near the Santa Rita Mountains. Sky Island Adventures is one of his businesses. We've had a family of quail move in. I think they're congregating underneath that evergreen tree over there. And they spend a lot of time up there. We have this bird feeder and they fight with the smaller birds. A pigeon is going to leave. Nope. Ran off the quail. Oh. <laughs> Oh, but look who came back. Got all my windscreen covers on. Ready for the Arizona sun while I'm gone. Gonna miss my Jeep. Of course, I've got the van and the BMW at home in Mexico, but we had a lot of good times exploring the mountains over there this year. Hopefully I don't have to gut the interior and the engine compartment to fix all of the pack rat problems when I get back again this fall. Well, if you have watched my videos for a while, you've probably seen that I have a collection of lizard shirts. Today, I got a new one. <laughs> Before I grabbed the camera, he was right here on my chest. Looked like he was part of my shirt. But now he's run up there on my neck. and He's probably getting warm enough to jump. I'm going to uh, try to get him back here where it looks like he's on my... Oh, there he goes. Where'd he go? Getting ready to jump. Huh? There he goes. You want to be a little closer to the ground? Go ahead. Maybe he just likes my body heat. Let's take you over here in the yard before you jump off. Oh, look, you can even see the shadow. <laughs> Uh, 
this would be a nice place. This would be a nice place for you to live right over here. But I know you want to be in the sun, so I'm going to let you out right here. Hop off. Piggyback ride's all over with. Are you still there? I can't tell. Is he still there? Yep, he's still there. Hey, get down. Well, hmm. I might need help. He's not getting off. So the question is, how did he get up there in the first place? Well, he was cold. <laughs> I just picked him up, and put him right here on my shirt and walked around the property for quite a while before he decided to get be warm enough to move up on my shoulder. Now I'm going over here. See if I can get somebody to help me get this thing off of me. <laughs> you on your back? He's on my back, isn't he? <laughs> yes. Are you going to grab here? You used to work at the zoo. Grab that lizard, <laughs> would you? I don't know. He's become quite the handler. Whoa! Did he jump yet? I got it. Nope. Okay, put him in the sun. Oh, Look at that blue. Wait a minute. Look at that blue. Oh, isn't he beautiful? The uh, in California we have blue bellies, which this is obviously related to the blue belly. It's actually a spiny lizard, but uh, they're a lot bigger than blue bellies. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. There's some of them. There's the emerald green ones down here too, and I don't think they're native. He likes your warm hand too. He does. Look at that smug face. Yeah. Doesn't care. Like he's just closing his eyes. Yeah, I'm doing doing nothing. Yeah, ooh, loving it. It's gonna suntan. Yeah. S named him Peter. Scleroporus. Peter Jr. Or Scleroporus. Scleroporus? Yeah. Inglés, por favor. He's pretty chill. Yeah, he's pretty chill. Look at, this, look at the black patterning on these yeah. hands. Yeah. He's, he's sitting out there on the hill. I was caught up with him and just, I was petting him. Green. Turquoise green. I'm assuming it's turquoise. Okay, well, we're making a video and you have to show him. We have to show you releasing him. Come on. I know. I know. Actually, let's put him on the tree. Put him on the tree. But he wants to Whoop. be in the... Ooh, there he goes. See you later. Lively. Yep. Adios. Have you seen any squirrels today? Um... While you were having a nap? Yeah. A squirrel came up the steps and said hi to me twice. He wasn't saying hi. He got up this far and decided he didn't want to... Say hi to me. He took off. Oh, I kept yelling, no, 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 to him. Yeah, he was in the was. squirrel was in the bedroom the other day. And the hummingbird, hummingbird's been in here several times. And that big pigeon was in. The big pigeon, yeah. The rabbit hasn't come in. No. Our friend Aaron. Wrong direction, unless Made you're doing a short. our last meal. It's up to interpretation. We're very close to Mexico. Very close. We're not close to there. Mexico. So tell us what we have here. All right, we've got grilled honeydew, potatoes are gratin with bacon. Mm -hmm. We've got a cilantro green chili cotija pumpkin seed pesto pasta with grilled smoked chicken and bacon, grape tomatoes. We've got a uh, cucumber shallot, white wine vinegar, uh, lemon juice, lemon zest salad, and the bacon bomb is a butterfly chicken breast pounded out, filled with uh, cotija cheese, um, cream cheese, chipotle, uh, smoked, uh, well, grilled green chilies, wrapped in bacon, and in the smoker. There we go. Too many things. Too many things. Think too complicated. Think heaven. A uh, question. Do you like to cook? Yeah. <laughs> That's what keeps me sane. <laughs> That's his plate. Here's my plate. I'm going to eat. First one on the plane again. Hi, friends. You may guess that I am back home in Ajijic, Mexico. Lush and green and beautiful and very different.
from our time in Arizona. Uh, today I'm liking green. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.